Hey, what is up everybody? This is Steve Breach coming to you here today. I'm rolling over to Costco. Uh, hopefully the uh, the lines won't be too bad. And then I have a pickup honestly to make at uh, Walmart. Uh, just didn't want to wait for it to get shipped to my house. But uh, I, I, I guess yesterday was Black Friday. Monday is going to be Cyber Monday. Is there any days, any, any name for what Saturday and Sunday is for you know the, the the weekend of everybody going out and getting ready for uh, Christmas stuff. Here I see more people buying Christmas trees than anything else. But um, I can tell you this much: a game snuck up on me. Uh, Niners and Saints coming up this Sunday. Um, I did my picks uh, probably Wednesday for the week. I knew that there was games. I watched all three games on Thursday. Although this was the first year that I really cooked. Thanksgiving dinner by myself. I, I can honestly tell you there was large gaps um, of the middle game that uh, I just didn't get to see because the fact that I freaking was busy. <laughs> I had my hands all up in the in the air fryer. I had them in the uh, the oven. I was stirring stuff on the uh, on the stove. It was it was just nuts. Uh, the pressure to make sure that when we sat down, everything was going to be hot and fresh instead of like it was done a half hour ago. But um, I don't really have many memories. I can tell you that I'm glad the Niners didn't play on, on, on Thanksgiving. The two games that I can remember them playing uh, was us losing a snoozer of a game between the Niners. <coughs> Sorry. The Niners and the Ravens well over uh, 10 years ago. Uh, I, I mean, I think the final score was like 6-3 to three or something like that. And... Um, I don't know. It was just one of those things. Uh, watched a little bit of the first half, drove home, and um, you know, just sort of thought about it and was like, you know what? <laughs> I'll take the L on this one. I'm going to bed. Uh, it just wasn't worth um, staying up uh, to watch that game. And uh, the Niners lost. There was no touchdowns in that game, I believe. The other one was uh, a little bit more of a competitive match, but uh, we lost to the Seahawks like we did for a long time there. So um, we're gonna be playing on Sunday. Like I said, this game snuck up on me. I didn't really prepare a lot for it, but uh, Niners and Saints. Saints going with their uh, starting quarterback, Andy Dalton. Um, supposed to be quarterback number one last year, last year in Chicago. It didn't really work out for them. They ended up bringing in uh, Justin Fields and uh, that got off the ground and he ended up as the backup for Jameis. Jameis got hurt a while ago, and uh, Dalton's been, uh, you know, man in the team. I can honestly say, you look at this Saint team, the little bit that I've seen this year, it's just not the same Saints team, you know, uh, when uh, Drew Brees was running around there, where they were just gunning the ball. It didn't ma matter how many they were down. You knew that, you know, just a few plays, you give that offense a chance, they're going to score. This looks like an offense that's just hoping to find some rhythm and they know that they're not there they're um they're not tearing it down but they are in a rebuild mode i guess you can say and uh, the niners are completely the opposite you know debo samuel as of right now looks like he's uh, gonna be a coin flip decision whether if he's in or out he's got a hamstring problem and um i know that the niners have a lot of a lot of weapons but we just have to find a way to balance these weapons all at the same time. Jimmy G last year, last week uh, looked like a Pro Bowl quarterback. Uh, four touchdowns, two of them uh, to Ayuk. Uh, Debo had one. And, uh, you know, we just have to find a way. I know that, you know, if Debo's not going to be in there, I know Juan Jennings and uh, Brendan Ayuk are going to step up uh, and be valuable uh, guys running around out there trying to catch balls. Uh, but just, I think we need to find a way to put it together and show, you know, what we got going on. Injuries are injuries. That's why they play the game in the NFL. But um, this Niners team is built to win. And I, honestly, a few times this year, uh, a few of the L's we've taken, teams haven't beat us. We just beat ourselves. Uh, whether if that was that Bears game or, or a few other ones along the way. But, uh, you know, we're putting it together. We got the winning record. Uh, I think the Saints are four and six on the year, so they're just trying to find a way to get through. Um, 
But uh, I, I have strong hopes of this being a big W for us, and I, and I think we're going to be building it in. Um, like I said, I was as unprepared for this game. I don't know if it's going to be a morning game uh, because of the fact that it's uh, it's in New Orleans, I'm pretty damn sure. Or if it's going to be a little bit later where I can actually see it and I won't be working. But uh, I can tell you one thing or not. Uh, I'll have it in my ear, and I'll, have, I'll be banging along with it. Let's go, Niner gang. Um, feeling a pretty good W here. I know we are um, favored by nine. But I think this is a game we can win by more than that. I, I just honestly think we got this one in the bag. We got this one covered. I'm going into Costco now, so uh, wish me luck. All I really need is Pepsi, but we both know I'm going to probably walk out of there with like $100 worth of crap. So let's see. Peace out, guys.